Hello and welcome. This is Vince of VincePrep.com. We're in day number, I need to count, we're in a uh, sort of virtual lockdown here in Tokyo. And I've been thinking a lot about this situation and how history or the idea of thinking about our current moment from a much wider perspective. And I just want to make a short video to those of you who watch these videos, and I really appreciate your time. Think of some way, think of some way to get beyond yourself in this moment uh, of uncertainty. Um, a small example is uh, just in a few hours now, I'll be doing online improv for a friend of mine whose kids are stuck at home. Um, improv is something I've loved teaching over the years. I've taught middle and high school level improv. I've also taught adults um, corporate training. Um, it's a way for me to get back in touch with a part of myself that I miss. And it's a, it's a, it's a time, it's a way for me to give something to the world that I think can be very useful in this moment, in these moments of uncertainty. Improvisation is not about comedy as much as it is about listening and teamwork and uh, being agile and flexible, uh, noticing the gifts. Another thing that I'm doing on, as a volunteer at the moment is helping my, my mentor, Patricia Ryan Madsen. I'm taking a look at her, um, manuscript for for another book that she's hoping to publish and there's, there's just little ways of little things that i'm doing and for those of you who are watching this who are in high school or um stuck you know sort of waiting to go back to college um look around you and find ways in your immediate circle it doesn't have to be helping someone on the other side of the world or you know donating money to some charity somewhere it's really more a matter of looking around in your immediate circle and being useful to those 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 with whom you are you are already in touch i always give this speech to my clients um those of my clients that are based here in japan sometimes worry that they don't have as much community activity um as their american counterparts um you know, donating time and money and not hold the whole world of nonprofit or not for profit uh, organizations is, is a well developed part of the US economy. Sort of in between the government and private sector, there's this sort of not for profit or nonprofit sector. Um, and it's advice I think I can give to anyone, which is give, you don't need to start something brand new, you can simply re engage with communities that have mattered to you in the past your high school alumni association your college if you're out of college already um, look for ways to get involved and help people in your immediate circle it's a good use of time as we all wait around for the for school to start again for the economy to to to, to restart for people to be allowed to get go back about their daily business um, so just a little bit of sort of words of encouragement in the midst of this uh, unprecedented <laughs> time of uncertainty. So I, one of the, my co favorite columnists in the newspaper was talking in the column I started reading about um, BC and AC, before Corona and after Corona. Um, it's gonna be a different world. Um, so get a head start and reconnect with those groups or people or activities that mattered to you in the past. Um, all right, that's it for now. As always, please subscribe to my channel. Subscribers are the first to know when I make new videos. I love making these videos every chance I get. That's all for now. Take care. Take care of yourselves and take care of each other. Bye for now.